Hey y'all, it's me, Lynn Daniel, coming to you today. It is Thursday, June 26, 2014. So, today is my mom's birthday. Hi, mom! I stopped by the house to visit her today, and I guess she was already gone, because I didn't get to see her. She wasn't there, so anyway... So, Mom, I left what I could, and the rest I just brought back home. So, whenever you get ready to party, I know, right? Look, I have been, my, my focus has totally been in the books. And for my friends who have gone through this process or who are going through the doctoral program, they totally understand it. I knew it was going to be a lot of work, but... Um, I had no idea that I I knew it was going to be a lot of work, but it's it's a lot of work, y'all. It's like every waking moment is it creeps in. It creeps into your thinking, your planning, your day. It's a lot. So I'm glad that I'm doing it on something that I'm using that's going to be helpful and beneficial to me, but I just want my folks who aren't engaged in the doctoral studies to know that it's real deal, heavy duty commitment. So, so yeah, so, so yeah, mom, I'll see you when you want to see me. <laughs> So you all, okay, so today I'm coming together to just do a collage. I was filming about my updated hair care regimen. I am regimen. to talk a little bit about my hair care regimen, my journey, what I have been doing. And I know I wear protective styles 99.5% of the time. When I'm home, I'm either in them or not. If you see me mowing my lawn, you may see my natural hair because oftentimes I will, um, you know, wear my, my hair in plaits, uh, you know, around the yard or if I'm in the neighborhood just running in and out of the store very quickly. But typically I am in one of my wigs. So what you all are looking at are the um, products that I purchased for the summer and for this next leg of my um, hair care talking journey. about I'm increasing my use of different um, oils on my hair to retain growth to reduce breakage because in 2012 I wasn't really paying attention I hadn't found a, an oil product or a hydrating moisturizing product and I was breaking my hair after especially after shampooing um, when my hair is at its curliest and especially that I have no relaxer now it's so important to find something that will create slip and so that's what I did so I put together a video for you all and I'll just insert some of it in here so that you all can know. So this is going to be like a little collage video of everything that I'm doing so far this summer. Um, but I wanted today to talk a little bit about this um, video that I saw the other day called I Pet Goat 2. I Pet Goat 2. by a, a Canadian company called Heliophant. And this video is prophetic. It is about um, end time prophecy and it is quite provoking. And if you haven't viewed it, I encourage you to view it. And I also encourage you to view um, a solid interpretation video that explains the imagery because it's full of imagery. No 
dialogue or no, it's open to interpretation, but there is, there is a message in that video. Um, I wanted to hear what the designer or the artist who put it together said, and he was not very willing to interpret it for you. He wanted you to interpret it for yourself. So, you know, I found that kind of interesting because most artists, I know when I write songs, I do leave a little room for interpretation, but I want you to get the main message of my song. So I don't know. Anyway, but um, if you haven't viewed that video, I Pet Goat 2, I Pet Goat 2, Google it and view it. It's on Vimeo, it's on YouTube, and then I'll put a link below of um, some interpretation videos that I found to be quite helpful. I'm, I went old school. Old school, that means I returned to some old tried and true products from when I was a young girl and I wore an afro. And I'm going to insert pictures of me um, throughout, you know, just my hair throughout my life. <music>all can get an idea my hair is like either a 3c 4a is sort of uh, is very soft it's light density it has a nice natural curl to it um, I really like my hair but for real my hair does not hold a style it really is difficult to hold a curl um, so even, I don't know, even before like relaxes were out, a press and curl just didn't really work for me. Um, but I do want to ask you all before I insert pictures of, you know, the clips about my hair and stuff. If you were, if our world monetary system just changed overnight to where we all were forced to accept some sort of mark on our hand or forehead in order to buy or sell, would you take that mark? Would you allow yourself to be pressured into taking the mark? Um, have you thought about that? Because, I mean, I remember learning about this some time ago in church and thinking it was so far off in the future. And yeah, a lot of years have passed, but I just never figured that I would see so much unfolding in my lifetime that parallels with the book of Revelation and with just end time prophecy. So, especially that our monetary system, not just in the Americas, but worldwide, the monetary system is so interconnected to where it's pretty much a done deal. It's pretty much obvious in every country. You have Greece, you have other countries that, you know, um, Argentina, they said it used to be a very wealthy country. Now it's poor, you know. Um, so I don't know. Would you take a mark? if you were forced to or made to or told that's the only way you could get food and water and pay your bills. That's something to think about. So watch the video I Pet Goat 2. And then, yeah, watch my video about hair. I mean, look, hair is the last thing on my mind, really, when it comes to considering your life choices or whatever, but we still have to keep living and enjoying those things in life that bring us joy. So, happy birthday, Mom. I'm going to go in here and get back in these books because I have one more assignment that's due by the end of the week, the start of the new week, and then I'm through. I have to um, finish revising a few things, and then I'm done So for the summer. All right, so be blessed. Love you. Bye. And that when your hair is dry, it's going to break and you're not going to have any length or retention. So to avoid the um, snapping and breaking, I purchased this comb, um, 
a few weeks ago from the same local dealer where I bought the S curl no drip stuff so I got these here locally and I like this because um, it's just easy to comb and but I was still getting some snapping with that so I ordered this from Amazon um, because I was ordering some books for class so I saw this on there and I ordered this for like three bucks and I used this I love it because you see how wide the teeth are I get no breakage at all very 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 little even after shampooing so this I think now that I have the right tools I dropped it I've got to wash it now now that I've got the right tools I really think that I will be able to achieve my hair um, growth. I'm, I'm looking to do like six inches in six months. So I think I can get there. Now, 